British Navy seizes Iranian boat carrying missiles. Western powers say they have intercepted another illicit shipment of Iranian weapons, the seventh such seizure in the past three months. The seizure announced by Britain took place last month in the Gulf of Oman. Britain's defense ministry said it began tracking the Iranian vessel on February the 23rd when it noticed the ship traveling at high speeds under the cover of darkness. Royal Marines then boarded the ship after the suspected smugglers initially ignored calls from Britain's HMS Lancaster and tried to return to Iranian territorial waters. The United States said it provided airborne surveillance during the operation, which took place along a route historically used to traffic weapons unlawfully to Yemen. Both Britain and U.S. Naval Forces Central Command, based out of Bahrain, said the Iranian ship was carrying Iranian versions of Russia's 9M133 Cornet anti-tank guided missiles and medium-range ballistic missile components. Britain's ambassador to the United Nations, Barbara Woodward, said on social media that she has notified the UN Secretary Council of the seizure. According to the US, this is the seventh time in just the last three months that Western allies have intercepted Iranian vessels trying to smuggle weapons and drugs out of Iran. Those naval interdictions have led to the seizure of more than 5,000 weapons, 1.6 million rounds of ammunition, 7,000 proximity fuses for rockets, 2,100 kilograms of propellant for rocket-propelled grenades, 30 anti-tank guided missiles, medium-range ballistic missile components, and 80 million pounds worth of illegal drugs, the U.S. said. Earlier this week, a top U.S. defense official warned Iran's increased cooperation with Russia has made the regime in Tehran a global challenge. <laughs>